what's up guys my name is Jay and in this video I'm gonna show you how to set up a WordPress multi-site and how to make money with it all right now I have here a fresh WordPress installation It's the same thing you don't have to go and search for how uh, you know how to download a WordPress multi-site because it's the same thing you just go to WordPress download the same WordPress but we need only one line of code to convert the regular WordPress to multi-site. All right, so I'm gonna go to my text editor and I have here my wpconfig.php, all right? So I'm gonna scroll down a little bit and right here in this comment that says, that's all, stop editing, happy blogging. So right here, I'm gonna add this code. All right, and we save it. And now we go back to our WordPress. Let's reload this. And now, when you hover on tools, you will, you will see uh, the network setup. It was not there, and now it's there. So I'm gonna click there, and you will see the installation process right here, okay? So we have a note, make sure you read that and everything is done. Um, they give you options of subdomains, or sub up, which this is the one that I like. So I'm gonna leave it like that. And your network title, you can change it, and your uh, network admin email. I'm fine with that, so let's click install. And now you have to do some changes here. They give you some instructions. So they say, go to your wpconfig.php and go to the comment above the line reading that's all stop editing happy blogging you have to add this so i'm going to copy this go to my p uh, um wpconfig.php and right here i'm going to add all the those codes i'm going to save it and let's see what else we got scroll down a little bit and they say that you have to add this code to your dot ht axis right so i'm going i'm going to just copy this actually you have to replace the one that you have right so i'm going to just remove all this and copy the new one i'm going to save that and go back reload the page all right so we have here now as you can see we have network settings and network setup, which is this one right here. And if you go here, you will see something very different. You have a network admin dashboard sites, username themes, and you have my site. Now, one of the benefits of having a multi-site is that you can control uh, a lot of different WordPress websites with one uh, admin dashboard. So it's this kind of uh, super admin. Another benefit is that when you update your WordPress, it will update all the WordPress under this uh, network. So it's, everything is faster and everything is like connected, you know? Now let's create a site real quick here. So I'm gonna hover here on sites. I'm gonna add new. Let's say I have a client that wants a simple SEO blog or something like that. All right, so this is my main domain that I'm using. So it's gonna be like, I don't know, SEO, Let's say the title is SEO and the admin email is gonna be, I'm gonna use my other email, all right? Let's click add site, all right? So you, the site is already created. Let's see all sites. And as you can see, I have here one, I already had one created just for testing car rentals. And now I created this one uh, named SEO. So. What I want to do now is go to that dashboard. As you can see, you can do it right here. And you can see we have a complete new dashboard for that site. And we can here, you know, uh, install themes, which I think they, yes, we only have one theme available. And you can go back there to your admin dashboard, to your super admin dashboard, go to your themes. And as you can see, we have like an option here to network enabled. That means that when you enable this one, let's click on it. 
Now everyone can install this theme, all right? So you can disable and they don't have access. The same thing with the plugins, okay? Now if I go there, let's go to all sites, and then I go to the dashboard of that new SEO site, let's go to the themes, and now you can see that we have that available. So our client have another new theme available and he's gonna be very happy, okay? Now, I wanna make money with this. How do I make money? How can I charge? How can I you know, make things easy for, the, for, the, for my client? This is when the fun begins, okay? Now, my friends from WPMU Dev, they have a cool plugin named Pro Sites. You can install this plugin. You can create like a website just like WordPress. They have an option that you can uh, create your own blog for free. And then you can, uh, you know, pay a pro membership and you can add more theme, more stuff. That's what you can do. So as you can see here, they give you the option to create your own plans. You can, uh, you know, charge by month to month or a whole year. Uh, you can add, like, this is actually this is my favorite thing to do. I can create other themes, and if you don't have the pro access, so let's say you have three different plans: the basic, the the one in the middle, and there's the 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 pro version. And you can actually give them access only if they have the pro version. It sounds like a plan. It sounds like a cool business. Okay, so they, they can go to your website, choose a plan, pay you right there, and they will have access right away to their own WordPress installation. They can start adding plugins that you provide, the themes that you provide, and stuff like that. All right, so you can see that you have all the options here and you can actually make money and create a whole business. In this video, I am not installing the plugin because I'm creating a whole video tutorial about this plugin only, all right? So if you wanna learn, subscribe and I see you next week. Thank you for watching and have an amazing day. Bye.